What is going on guys? Welcome back to Broncos franchise and welcome to draft day. A little nervous. I have a list of all the players I'm interested in. We can get most of them. There's three, four, five guys I really, really want. I'm hoping we can make it happen. Um, let's see. Yeah, I think we'll just kind of let the draft play out since we got the new screen here. We'll have the players come up on stage with uh, the commissioner. And we'll at least do it like this for like the first five picks. I mean, the first three we'll do it with the time counting down. Kind of simulate like we're in... Real draft day here. I did the bell up to the stand to make the call. This should be right end uh, Davis. Potentially, it is going to New England. Brian Davis with the number one overall pick going to New England. As the mock draft pre predicted, uh, and if the mock draft starts, you know, predicts the future, uh, Carolina is going to be going with the right outside linebacker, Rodgers. The pick is in. Let's see who we end up choosing here. And it is going to be the right outside linebacker, Rodgers, going to Carolina. With that, we are on the clock with the third overall pick. We're going to be taking our new running back, Dennis Hayden. Get him out on stage here, boy. Take a look and see how we did drafting wise. Let's rank number one in true value. We drafted him at three. Shifty with great juke move, possesses elusive spin move, shows great contact balance to break tackles. Does have hidden dev. 94 speed, that's what we like to see. All right, I'm happy with that pick. Picks in right away. We will see Cleveland Browns gain their new quarterback in Jay Blackman. We'll pause the draft and skip ahead to the next pick. Tennessee Titans are going to be taking wide receiver short. Bears. We're mocked to take right end Terry here. We did, John Terry. Saints are going to go quarterback Isaiah Leak. So they are going to end up replacing Derek Carr, potentially. Marcus Borden going to uh, the Buccaneers. I had a brain fart for a second there. All right, 
I'm gonna go look for a trade quick. So there's one player I need, but he's not mocked to go until towards the end of the first, so I'm gonna try and get a couple extra picks out of it. Alright, I think we are gonna take this deal from the Dolphins. I actually might go and manually do a deal with them and see if I can get a little bit more. So I'm going to try that quick. Figure out where to go for the trade. But yeah, let me try and get that done and then I'll let you guys know what we come up with. Alright, so the trade went through with the Dolphins. We are giving them the ninth overall pick for the 37th, uh, the 32nd. Uh, their second, so pretty much end of the second round. Uh, their first rounder next year and a second rounder in 2027 for obviously the ninth overall pick this year. Um, a fourth next year, a third, sorry, a fourth this year, a third next year, a fifth and a seventh in 2027. So kind of a lot to give up there, but yeah. We'll see who they take. They are going to take Devin Smart with that pick. All right. I am going to try and trade back up. I think I want to get up to probably 20. So with the Falcons. Well... guy I wanted wasn't supposed to go till 31 so maybe we can go to like the Eagles at 25 we'll see if he's still there by then Mitch Davis left end going to Giants Jets taking quarterback Greg Kirkpatrick He wasn't even mocked to go anywhere. Terrell Sutton being taken by the Texans. Greg Morse, wide receiver to the Raiders. Lions taking Norwood. Commanders taking Thurman Black, right end. Steelers going Trent Belton. Rams going Tyler Dawkins. Right tackle Robertson going to the Bills. William Sullivan right tackle going to Seattle. Jer Manning going to the Falcons. Get caught up on my... Mock draft here. Sullivan Manning. All right. Kyle Pearson. That's who they had us mock to take at nine. Obviously, we weren't going to do that. Justin Miller. Left tackle going to the Chargers. Allridge, left tackle going to Minnesota. Keon Frost, defense tackle. Beautiful last name. I love that last name. Going to Baltimore. And the Eagles taking Larry Howard, right guard. Cincinnati, going Tony Hoskins, wide receiver. Indianapolis, Jake McLean. Right tackle. The tight end I was looking at still there for uh, Shorn Barden. Wide receiver going to Dallas. And I think now is when I make this trade. I'm going to do it with Green Bay. Not that I think that they would take him. Actually, I know that they won't take them. They got Ryan Kelly. Okay. 
49ers were the ones to mock him, and it does look like they would. Chiefs are good, so I might just trade up with the 49ers here. Hopefully I don't have to give them too much. We are just going to go with a 6 rounder in 2027 and hope for the best. Almost. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. What if I... Give you a second next year. Take your third, your fourth. And your third next year. Almost. Keep second next year. Yep. We can go with the fourth in 2027. Maybe we can even sneak. Fourth in next year? Maybe not, but we'll see. Nope. Can I make that a fifth? I don't have a fifth. Let's go six. Let's see what happens with that. Nada. We'll go with the fourth. We'll give him a little extra, I feel like. But that'll work. We'll sneak up. We'll get our center. As the Packers are going to take Montague. I'd imagine the Chiefs go Starks here. They do. And we will take our new starting center in Clint Rollins. Ranked number three in true value. Drafted him at 31. Beautiful scouting done by us. Now the rest is pretty much, uh, <laughs> the rest is pretty much up to chance, man. We'll resume the draft, we'll just kind of let everything play out. Oh, come on, my cat's making a mess. Meow, meow, meow. They don't. What are the 49ers doing here? They took Holt. I don't know who that is, but all right. Do I want to try and trade up again? Mark Burr is still on the board. see here <laughs> all right that's that's the trade <laughs> oh goodness Right tackle, Bacon going to uh, New England, Tyrone Gordon, Carolina, Tyrone Short going to Arizona, Pat Cheney. Send our pick, Bryson, Godfrey, Dixon, and Harris. All get selected right there. Ooh, 
Atlanta wouldn't be bad, but we did just get left tackle in free agency. I think we're going to have to go Mark Burr here. Yeah, we got Dulcich, but... This guy's kind of a freak. Forty-four in true value. That's not good. <laughs> but he does have a awareness, a route running. Uh, let's see here. I may try and trade back up into the second round again. I do kind of want like the Lions pick. Just to secure the guy that we want there. And I am tempted to shoot him our first next year. Then in return, I kind of want yeah, a couple seconds from him. Second this year, second next year. Where was this at? Pretty darn close. Uh, we could... Probably give them a third. Take their third in a second, maybe? First, next year, third, 27 for second this year, second next year, and second in 27. I don't like that. All right. Uh, yeah. Yeah, that'll get her done. All right. All right, Giants take Blanton, Jets take Grant, Nash goes to Houston, Jackson goes to the Raiders, and we are going to take our right outside linebacker, Mr. J.R. Forden. Nineteenth in true value. Took him at forty six. He is hidden dev. Should be a great athlete for us. Alright, let's get through the rest of the second round here. Carrington going to Washington. Spriggs going to Pittsburgh. That's our next pick. Three seven. Winthrop. Bozeman. Hagen, Shepard going to Seattle. Von Ingram, right guard going to Atlanta. Norris, free safety going to uh, Jacksonville. Chargers taking Edison, right guard. Austin. That's staying in Boston. It's going to Minnesota. Harmon. Friday. Select next by Bowman going to Cincinnati. Johnny Meeks by Indy. Flowers going to the Lone Star State. Nelson Tiller. Casey McCollum. 
Joe Marsh. A couple tight ends being selected there. And Selby. Go to our next pick here. We got Braden Matthews, Davidson, Straight, and Leary. Game taken. And Griffin. Alright, this one might be a little bit of a reach here, but we're going to go left guard Evan Arnett with our pick. Maybe not. Rank 13, took me at 71. He is hidden dev. So at least star for a left guard, it's not bad. I thought that was going to be a bit of a reach, but I guess not. Next pick I kind of want is St. Clair. Doesn't look like he got taken, so... Might be at our selection here. And he is. Alright, we are going to take Mantra St. Clair. Left outside linebacker. Doesn't look horrible. This one might be a reach, but we'll see. <laughs> Big reach. Apparently did not scout him very well. But that's alright. It's got a nice name. Maybe we can develop him pretty well. We'll see what happens with them. Ben Benson. Alright. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Here's where things get interesting. I do want Ben Rice. Right. He's fast. That's about all he's got. It's pretty much ass at everything. So I kind of want to save him for the next set of picks I got, which I think are fourth or fifth rounders. And then kind of just use him as a kick returner, but yeah, we are kind of at slim pickings here. We're only in third round. How does this guy look? Josh Rodriguez, obviously we don't need another tight end, but... Doesn't look horrible. 21 as well. Lots and lots of day threes here. Um, I am going to mess with the... Um, like the strengths of the classes in the future. I do have wheels set up, so next video we will be doing, we are going to be spinning some wheels and determining what the strengths of the classes are. Uh, let's see. I'm not loving this guy. Where might be good? Ejected day three. Town is rounds two to three. It is twenty three. I might just be able to trade this pick away. It's our next pick four eight. Let's see what offers we get here. If we can get a second rounder, I'll take it. Nope. It's just moving back one spot. The next pick has been traded. Whatever. I'll do that and gain a seventh rounder next year. I am a okay with that. And yeah, I think we'll take Ware here. Dumb spot to take him, but doesn't look bad. He doesn't look great, but Rank is 80, we took him at 96. We are gonna end up taking Ben Rice here. With 104. Yeah, let's draft him. 
complete ass. Elite top end speed, serviceable hands, struggles to make catches in traffic. Normal dev, of course, should have 99 speed. He does, 95 acceleration, 94 jumping. And yeah, he's literally just going to be a kick returner for us. Nothing special. Now is where we kind of get into our sloppy picks. I'm going to take Roger, you guys. He's still on the board here. Not worth it. <laughs> Not worth it at all. Got 31st pick here. And then after this, we got round 7. So, like I said, garbage time picks. But we'll take them. Which of these three look better? Great speed. Where is shoot tackle hit power B? Okay. Kinda want just to do that will kill someone. Coming over the top, you know? Slow as hell. Power B. Alright. He's out between Bayer or Bolden. Whoever's got the better hit power, we're going with it. Hit power, see, all right. Bayer it is. Very much a stretch or a reach, but they say it's not bad. 118, took him at 127. Anyone speed. All right. Seventh round picks are going to be our kickers. Kickers and punters. Overall, I would say not a horrible... Not a horrible draft. How many picks we got here? Just two? Alright. Well, let's see here. Just kidding, I guess it's just our kicker. Punter was already drafted. Bam. Ranked 37th in true value, and we took him at 195. 90 kick power. Where's kick accuracy? It's an A, so. Hoping it's 99. Who knows? With the last pick, we are going to try and make our Brock Purdy selection here. Any young guys left? Is 21, 21, 21. No quarterbacks. We'll go with Vernon Coleman. I'll give him a shot. Very last pick in the draft. All right. Let's take a look at this draft recap. So I'm excited. Excited to see how we did. Hopefully, made all the right selections. 81 overall, Dennis Hayden. Obviously, he's going to have hidden dev, I'd imagine. Yes. Beautiful. Rollins should also have hidden dev. Yep. I forgot who we did check. I think Mark Burr. No. No, he's normal. Not good. <laughs> oh, yeah. It was our Arnett here. Mr. Arnett. He was hidden dev. We didn't check Forden. Hidden dev. All right. We'll take that. We'll take that. Monster St. Clair. I know he's going to be normal. Jeff Ware. Don't think we checked. Normal. Imagine everybody else is going to be normal here. Maybe our kicker has hidden dev? Nope, normal. Alright. Not bad. 81, 79, 73, 74, 75. And yeah, then we kind of took a little hit here. 
65, 70, 65, 65, 68, 73. But, I mean, honestly, the classes weren't that great after the third round. We did get the highest overall in Dennis Hayden. So, I knock on wood, we made the right move. Getting rid of Javante Williams, taking him. We also had second highest overall in Clint Rollins here at 79, tied with Jay Black, for the new quarterback for the Cleveland Browns. Nash isn't bad either. Imagine he's hidden dev. We are going to take a peek at and see what he is. Superstar. All right. He was on my list of running backs as well to look at. Who did he go to? Texans. All right. Let's take a look at Blackman. Let's see what his dev trade is. It is only a star. All right. Don't think I want to look at anybody else. Maybe Gordon. I did want Gordon. Let's see if we messed up and didn't take the right free safety here. Star. All right, not bad. We can look at short two. Short's another one that I was interested in. It's normal dev. All right, interesting. Let's see if there's anybody else. Not really. I think maybe Manning was the other wide receiver I was looking at, but it didn't look too interesting. He is hidden dev. Interesting. Yeah, only a star. All right. We're not too mad. I, I got a feeling. Open Hayden is a superstar. Open our offensive line are both superstars as well. But yeah, we'll, we'll see. We'll see. But yeah, with that, next week we have preseason. And we should be taking that on Friday. Uh, as you guys are seeing this, this is going up on Wednesday. Um, then yeah, in two days we will have preseason out for you. We'll adjust our lineup right away, too. Should probably go get a backup quarterback in case Bo Nix gets injured. Um, yeah. Next video, we will be spinning the wheel to... Um, actually, we can probably do that quick here. I don't see why not. Let me make sure this is all situated and then we'll switch over and spin that wheel. Right, we'll, we'll take a look at the rest of our guys quick. Hold on. Chill, chill, chill. I put Ford in at left or right end here. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see what happens. Ben Rice. Oh, it's going to be amazing having him as our kick returner. Alright. It's going to be like a second for you guys, but probably a couple minutes for me. Uh, we will go ahead and get to the wheel spins. Alright, so here our uh, here are our wheel spins. Um, so yeah, it's pretty much just to, to take the draft class off of normal for every single position because obviously it's not like that in real life. So we are just going to spin this. Whatever position is on the left. This was just a demo spin. This is not the real spin. But just for example, wide receiver is going to be very weak then. We will remove wide receiver from the wheel. And then they are stuck at very weak. 
and then we'll go and adjust that in Madden. So here goes the real spin. That was just a test one, just to show you guys what we're doing. Linebacker is strong. All right. Take them off the wheel. Spin all. Defensive tackle is going to be weak. And yeah, once we're done with this, we'll go into Madden. I'll show you guys all the whatever. Red receiver very weak. All right. Didn't matter if that one was a test or not. Jesus, this is going to be a horrible class. <laughs> Jesus, very weak for quarterback. Oh, hold on. We need to spin all. Hunter. Normal. Cornerback. Very weak. I feel like everything's getting very weak, man. Interior your offensive line. Normal. Safety is strong. Defensive end is strong. Tight end is strong. Tackle is weak. And what does running back get? Strong. All right. Not very good. All right, here we are back in Madden. Quarterbacks, very weak. Running back, strong. Wide receivers, very weak. Tight end, strong. Tackles, weak. Interior offensive lineman, normal. Defensive ends are strong. Interior defensive line, weak. Linebacker strong, very weak for corners, strong safeties. Kickers are very weak, and punters are normal. So, hopefully you guys enjoy this. Like I said, it's, it gives a little more realism to it. You know, obviously not every single year you're going to have a stacked wide receiver class or stacked quarterback class. This one, you know, not a very good quarterback or wide receiver class. So, it kind of brings more realism into it instead of just leaving everything at normal and... You know, you got three guys that are good in every single position. This way, you know, even though quarterback class and wide receiver class are very weak, you might have, you know, 285 overall guys in there. Who knows? That's, that's the glory of it. So, yeah, I um, hopefully you guys enjoyed that. If you did, leave a like. If you are new here, make sure you do subscribe. And Friday, we will get into preseason here. Check out all of our new rookies. And, yeah, see how everything turns out for next season. Yeah, that'll do it for this one, guys. Tell and stick cool. Peace.